Uh, okay, so this past year I had the privilege of being on American Idol. I made it to the, I was in the top 50 and it was by far the coolest experience. It's one of the coolest experiences I've ever had in my life. Um, in which I did not expect it to be so, I grew so much, you have no idea. So, if you're thinking about it, you should do it. It's fun, it's supposed to be fun. Um, my, everyone keeps asking for the advice. So, I don't like the word advice because I believe that all the answers are within you. And the things, like some things I would just say that helped me were Knowing my songs, like I played songs that I've played for a long time. If you're playing, if your first choice to play for the audition is like a slow ballad, have a upbeat song in your back pocket. If you're playing your first song with an instrument, have a song that you know that you can sing acapella, um, or acapella, whatever. And keep having that variety, because they may ask for them, they did with me. And so by doing that, you're kind of prepared for, you know, the twists. Also, have fun. Laugh at yourself. Be you. Everybody else is taken. They want you. Trust me. They want you exactly how you are. They do not want you dressed in sheep's clothes. They want you. 100%. My best piece of advice to you is that your secret weapon is you. Exactly as you are in every shape and every form. There is already a Katie, a Shirley, a Bob. They are taken. If you try to like conform and like dress a certain way or be a certain way, then you're you're putting yourself out of your sweet spot. Like your sweet spot is who you are. Be who you are. Because it's refreshing. Like think about the times when you've watched a performance and have been like, holy. It's when that person is just doesn't care. They don't care what anyone thinks. So go in there and don't care what anyone thinks. You're you. You're the best you there was. I would say some other advice is be comfortable. Some of the, one of the best pieces of advice that I was given before Hollywood week, be comfortable in your wardrobe. Meaning, if I'm worried that I'm wearing like a high top that I don't usually wear this and like I'm worried I'm gonna pop out and I'm trying to sing and I'm trying to be interactive and I'm so worried about my outfit, like, no. That's, just, that's, that's a simple fix. You need to wear what you're comfortable in. It, oh, you can't bend or you can't move or you can't ex like expand your diaphragm. No, wear what you're comfortable in. Wear what you want to wear. I I know because my mom has opinions about my clothes and my hair, and I just no no wear what you want to wear. Um, my other piece of advice would be introduce yourself to the people there, but trust yourself. I would say connect with the people around you if you want to, if you're comfortable, if you're an introvert and you want to read your book for a certain amount of time. Like, that's what I did. I, I read books while I was there, which my mom was like, oh my gosh, get off the books. Like, of course I introduced myself to people that I was drawn to and that I felt a connection with and so, and their families. Um, and so I would, I would recommend doing that with the people you feel like you're supposed to and that that make you smile just by looking at them because you just the energy is there um